Hey, it's Tony with the latest rock news. The death of Chris Cornell hit many hard, including the pretty reckless's Taylor Momsen, who was on tour with Soundgarden at the time of the singer's passing. Momsen recently spoke with Matt Pinfield for his new and approved show, opening up about her final encounter with Cornell. I caught him as he was walking out and, you know, we had a nice little discussion. I gave him a big hug. Um, let's do it again sometime, kind of, you know, and... Uh, and then we continued on with the night, you know, hanging in, hanging in the, the back parking lot with, with Matt and Kim and Ben and, you know, the rest of our band. And again, Kato was there. And it was just it was just this big kind of celebration that we couldn't believe that we were um, that we were there. And that, you know, in one way, sad that, you know, the tour was over, but, you know, elated that we were a part of it. Like just is, you know, very, um, very great. We we were there that night in Detroit. We you know we played. That was the last night of that tour of the the, the leg of that tour. And the next morning, I woke up to the news um, of just is crushing. I, I could I was in disbelief. I guess is is the right word. I I I, I was convinced that everyone was lying to me. Um, and this was some awful joke. Momsen says she forged on with a few more shows before deciding to take a break. I was not emotionally prepared to kind of handle that kind of trauma and that kind of shock, she explained. In the time since, her bond with Soundgarden's members has only strengthened. She performed with the group at Cornell's 2019 tribute show, and Kim Thile and Matt Cameron both appear on the song Only Love Can Save Me Now from the Pretty Reckless's Death by Rock and Roll album due February 12th. For more on this story, head over to Loudwire.